Hello, social media. Hello, everybody. Hello. Welcome to Lakita T. Sharp's famous, exclusive, inspirational channel. I am so happy that you have decided to join me on today. So I welcome you. Hello, everybody. Hello out there. So happy to be with you and talking to you. So it's Thursday, October 10th. Can you believe it? October, November, October, November. Literally, we are about, what is this? October 10th, November 10th, November 10th to December 10th. We are literally under less than three months, you know, um, before the holidays, before Christmas. Like, that's crazy. Before even the new year, like literally October, November, December, three months you know, um, pretty much, and the new year is done, I mean, the year is done for 2024, <laughs> so it's crazy, right, I mean, literally, it's, it's really flying by for us, so I'm gonna get in, because I know you guys are ready for the message, and I'm um, pretty much letting the Lord speak on this one, I don't know what I'm about to say, I didn't plan for this, so Check out all of my books over at Amazon.com. There are over 100 books for you to choose from over at Amazon.com. And um, head over to my website for additional inspiration. And if you want um, to support the ministry, feel free to support the channel and donate to the ministry. So thank you so much. Um, yes, yeah, so... Let us go for today. Um, we're gonna talk about we're gonna talk about a lot of different things right now. So we're gonna talk about you know making it through and just going with the flow. You know, making it through and just going with the flow and just allowing God to work within you and allowing God and trusting Him to see you through you got to understand that when you put your trust and faith in the lord as you see the sign above me it says faith you know so literally if you have the faith sometimes you may not know how things are going to work out in your life sometimes you might not know how it's going to run and how it's going to go but you got to know that if you put your faith into it you know, that is going to work out in your favor. You got to understand that God is in control of everything. Literally, he is in control of how things are going in your life. You know, the little bitty things God cares about. You know, he cares about the little bitty things. You know, and I want you to know that it's so much, so much that God wants to do for you. You know, there's so much that he wants to do in your life. He wants to do through you and he wants to do, you know, for you, you know, so um, you just got to have faith. You know, sometimes we just don't know. We like, how is this going to work out? You know, and we are worried. We are worried. Have you ever been worried? And you have you ever been scared and you worried because you don't know how a situation is going to turn out for your favor? Well, I know I have. I have been scared plenty of times. Let me tell you this. I have been afraid plenty of times. You know, afraid, like, you know, God, is this going to work out for me? Is this going to work out? Sometimes I can allow my anxiety to, to get the best of me, you know, and I can I can become afraid, you know, because um, I don't know what's going to happen. Like, oh, my God, God, am I going to get approved for this? Oh, my God, God, am I going to get denied for that? You know, you know how you're filling out for an application for a job or for you know, or from a government program or for, you know, um, school or for, um, you know, DMV, whatever the case may be, whatever the case may be, you know, you're like, God, am I going to be denied? 
am I going to be denied? You know, is, are you going to deny me? And I am here to say to you that no, you know, no, God is not going to deny you. If it's for you, it's going to be for you. And it's going to work out for your favor if it's for you. I want to let you know that God is not going to let you down. God is not going to let you down. If I can tell you, you know, literally I was getting a notebook, right? So this is one of my notebooks that I have with um, me working on my projects right now. So, so this is one of my notebooks, right? One of my notebooks that I'm, you know, currently working in. So now listen to this, right? I forgot what I want to say. So anyway, I want to say to you that, what was the point, you guys? You guys help me. <laughs> oh my gosh, I kind of lost the point. But I want to let you know, you guys, that, you know, working in my notebook, like this is one of my notebooks or whatever, and I'm trying to think, I'll let it come up, you know, I let the idea, I let, I let it come back or whatever. But I just want to let you know that you got to have faith. You know, you got to have faith and know that God is not going to let you down. And he is going to see you through and he is going to, you know, help you if you just keep the faith. You know, you may not know how things are going to go down. You may not know how things are going to work out for you, you know, but just know that if you have the faith, you see that sign, that sign, have faith. If you just have the faith, you know, I, like literally, that's what I was going to say with the notebook. Thank you, Lord. With the notebook, right? I was going to get a notebook to write down everything that God has done for me over the years. Everything that God has done for me over the years. Do you know that I lost count? I'm like, I can't even keep up with how much money and how many things that God has done in my life. Like literally, I cannot keep up with everything that God has done. Like it's just too much. <laughs> You know, I can write down some things, you know, and how some things are written down. But, you know, mostly it's it's a lot. It is a lot. Um, it's just a lot. So, I want you guys to know that you guys, if you just extend your faith a little bit. That's all I'm saying. If you just extend your faith a little bit. And, you know, sometimes you're going to be scared. Sometimes you are going to feel very scared at times. You're going to be feeling afraid of things. But God always tell his servants. He always tells his servants. You know, I believe he was telling Joshua. You know, in Joshua 1.8, I believe that's the correct verse. Um, Joshua 1.8, he's saying, you know, be bold and courageous i believe he's saying that in joshua 1 8 let me find my one of my hold on let me find my phone let me see let's look up let's look it up joshua 1 8 okay oh no this is joshua 1 8 is saying something else so let's look up where it says be bold and courageous be bold and courageous joshua 1 9 i'm sorry that was joshua 1 9 have i not commanded you be strong and courageous do not be afraid do not be discouraged for the lord your god is will be with you whenever wherever you go so god is saying i know it's going to be hard i know it's going to be tough i know you're going to go through a lot of things in life i know so many things you're going to go through a lot of ups you're going to go through a lot of downs you may go through a lot of 
trials, a lot of tribulations, a lot of loss. But at the end of the day, you got to say, God is on my side. He is on my side. And especially when you are living right. When you are living right, when you are doing right, and when you are right, you got to know that God is on your side, you know, and you got to keep the faith, you guys, keep the faith. Remember, no matter what you are facing in this life, and this life is pretty much hard at times, right? You know, we go through different seasons in our life. Some of us are in, you know, the winning season. We are, some of us are in the waiting season and some of us are in the, um, you know, the season of your, you're at war. God bless you. God bless you to get through your war and season because that is a difficult and hard season when you are at war. You know, you are at war with the people around you and at war, you know, and when you're going through. So I, my, my, my blessings are with you during that season when you at war and you have to, and you have to walk on, um, you have to walk on pins and needles, you know, that, um, that is another case in itself, you know. So I want you to know that um, God is going to bless you guys. God is going to bless you guys. are going to get through and it's going to happen. It's going to happen. It's going to pop off. Whatever it is that God wants you to have is going to pop off. And I know it's been a long time. Some of you, it's just been such a long time coming. Such a long time. You are so in deserve of it. Some people in Hollywood, you know, got them a star. Congratulations to all of you who received the star on at, in Hollywood on, you know, your star. So congratulations to all of you receiving your stars. I know it has been a long time coming for you guys. You know, so I'm here to say to you that God is, he's, he's performing and God is going to give the people who deserve to get it, who have been waiting, who have been undervalued. God is giving you your flowers while you are living. You are going to experience your flowers while you are living. So I'm here to say to you that you're going to make it through. You're going to make it through. And I know you might be afraid, but God is with you every step of the way. He is with you <laughs> while you hold it down. He's with you while you take care of yourself. He is with you while you are taking a step forward. You know, let's give honor to the most high God for just being in our life today. You know, I know you might be going through aches and pains in your bodies and going through different things in your body and going and experience a lot of things. But I am here to say to you that to God be the glory. He is going to see you through. You are going to make it. You are going to overcome. You are going to push forward and things are going to work. Just know that God got your back. God got your back. Tomorrow, use faith. When you are faced with a situation tomorrow, even later on today, and when it's, you, you have to think about it, I want you to choose faith over fear. Remember, choose faith over fear. Choose faith over fear. There's two F's. Choose the uh, faith over fear. You get what I'm saying? Well, anyway, I love you guys. You guys be blessed. And remember, don't quit. You see that sign? Don't quit because we don't do that here. We do not do that here. Blessings to all of you. Thank you so much for watching. We are the chosen ones. We do right. We live right, babies. But we are the chosen. We are the chosen one. I will see you in the next video. See you later.